Spoilers. You have been warned. All of the Skywalkers are dead. The unironically titled Rise of Skywalker succeeds in, figuratively, exhuming the corpses of characters that were resting in peace to disrespect and defile their legacy and memory. Anakin's accomplishments invalidated, Palpatine returns with no explanation, this new trilogy amusingly succeeds in putting the final nail in a coffin to an unnecessary and unwelcome addition to what used to be the most popular franchise in the world. A premiere that George Lucas did not attend. But why stop at invalidating Anakin when you can do the same to Luke Skywalker? Strip him of what makes him who he became? All in service of casting Rey in a good light. I'll describe some characters and you tell me who sounds interesting and has somewhere to grow. Finn, a stormtrooper, a former stormtrooper, who's running away from his life of servitude. Kylo, a whiny, unintimidating, discount Darth Vader, living in the shadow of someone much greater before him. Poe, a talented but cocky, law-abiding pilot who maybe has a thing or two to learn about how he fits into the bigger picture. Or Rey, the perfect character, a character that therefore can't grow because you've already written them perfectly and refused to show as having any flaws because it conflicts with the incarnation of a woman that you are trying to push to force an unentertaining character as substantial as the dirt on the planet from which she hails as deep as the non-existent bodies of water on the desert rock she was raised but Ray's an expert swimmer, having never been in a large body of water before. She's a great pilot, having never flown before. She's an expert force user, outperforming people who've dealt with this shit their entire life, having never been trained. Thank God there's no Star Wars Olympics, because she'd win, hands down, blindfolded. That's who you wrote. And now, like Batwoman strolling into Bruce Wayne's Batcave and appropriating all of his gear for hers and then saying, I didn't need anything to get where I am. Ray takes that name. Ray is now Skywalker. Because you took it. And it's all yours. Whatever unlucrative, warped, poisonous incarnation you have turned it into. Try as you might, you'll never taint the original vision of these characters and the journey that they took many fans on. You'll never rob them of the impact that they had on not just specific individual lives, but a culture as a whole. And for as long as the Star Wars franchise exists, what Lucas established, the original characters, Luke, Han, Leia, Vader, Chewie, Yoda, Obi-Wan, Anakin. They'll be what people remember when they think Star Wars. This J.J. Abrams, Rise of Skywalker, it doesn't deserve anybody's money. And it's only going to get it because of what it was, not because of what it is. Fuck you.